looking like a metronome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me owe Oh, just let me oh. And this this funny, funny guy, Michael McCrudden. Michael McCrudden. Michael, Mc, Michael McGreedy. This guy. Yeah, should've should, should worked harder on the joke, but that's okay. Yes. Yeah, you're probably right. Maybe maybe you can read my mind. Uh um um real talk. I can. <laughs> this uh, nigga is greedy. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> like, Dang it. Michael Michael McGreedy. In a six day period, he pumped out three. Three and and one and three are almost identical, other than the fact that uh, there's been a rest between the, uh, uh, the the first one and the third one. The second one is just talking to artists and looking them up on YouTube. Um, I mean, look, I'm of the opinion. All right, I'm, I don't got a problem with monetizing death videos. I don't. I really don't. I'm not. But there's a way to do it. And there's a way not to do it. Yeah. 900,000, 1.4 million, 5.7 women. Whoopee! I was only in 1 million here. Oh, shit. Official Kevin Blanco. He knows what it's like to make a million. Vi yeah, he knows the deal. He knows how it's done. Official Ke Kevin Blanco in the chat. Holy shit. None of us are saints, bro. And I did like, I did enjoy his music. So I don't know what you're talking about. Rest, I'll be resting in peace, bro. I just started you know listening to it. It's I read my Bible every day. Do you really? Why do, do you, you really, read? John? I, you I really? can see that. Is that before I'm, or after you guys go to a lynching? Yeah. You know, I, th I, th I thought you were having... Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> woo -wee! I'm glad that guy... I'm not doing that. I'm not going that. I'm not going that. I'm not going that. I'm not going that. I'm not doing what I normally do. Now, as for the rest of the story, the well, it lives on through his music and his legacy because this is before they were gone. And I want to point out to some this... This show used to be called Before They Were Dead. That's how fucking uh, self-aware this guy is. The show used to be called Before They Were Dead. Then the algorithm changed. And he couldn't put death yeah. in the title. So it's now that it's Before They Were Gone. <laughs> now, we have made a number of videos in this series. I'm yeah, you have. Really? Really? You number, have. Yes, number sir. Being a key word, Tommy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll count them. One, part two, two part three. Coming up on part nine. Part, part nine. Part nine. He's still gone. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> He's still gone. Part nine. Of... What did what did he have for breakfast? Yeah. What did he have for breakfast? The, yeah, the, yeah. The, the 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 Instagram video that went into draft and never was released. Got it right here <laughs> before they were gone. Candy pens, and they've graciously stepped forward to help out with this. Oh, this is my favorite. This is my favorite. Now it wasn't monetized. This, this, this episode is brought to you by. There you go. Here you go. You hit it right in the head. When tragic news hits, people handle it in all sorts of different ways. I know when I heard the news of X's passing, I was tempted to step outside and light up a good old fashioned cigarette. <laughs> Shut the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it gets better. It gets wow. better. I've since found a new alternative through my collaboration with Candy Pens. <laughs> <laughs> Mike McCrud, next video funny. before they were gone, face banks hair. Ah! <laughs> listen, both you guys listen what? up. I want you to listen to this man and how shameless this fucker is. This is unbelievable. Oh my God. I've since found a new alternative through my collaboration with Candy Pens, and it's allowed me to find oh. a better aromatherapeutic way to not only deal with stress, but to relax and, you know, enjoy myself from time to time. <laughs> so let me rewind this shit. When he found out that fucking X passed away. Step outside and light up a good old fashioned cigarette. That's right. Your boy McCrudden is a smoker, or at least I used to be. I've since found a new alternative through my collaboration with Candy Pens, and it's allowed me to find a better <laughs> and more therapeutic way to not only deal with stress, but to relax and, you know, Enjoy myself from time to time. Yeah, enjoy yourself when you just find out your favorite rapper died. Come on, light up a candy with 25% off. BTWF25 is the promo code right away. This can't be real. This, this can't be real. This is, yeah. <laughs> This is real, motherfucker. <laughs> now, candy pens, they also have strong ties to the rap and hip-hop community. So it's okay if you're black. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know. I didn't know that, Tommy. <laughs> now I you do. Know. It's okay. You won't look like a candy ass with that pink candy pen in your hand. No, they got ties to the hip-hop community, you know? Yeah, you know, what, you know what it looks like when you're doing one of those things? Yes. There's no morals. The, ch the chat is stunned. This is tasteless. Yeah, and XXX tend to see on his fellow 2017 freshman class list member, PNB Raw. He <laughs> got that in there! X's friend smoked this shit. <laughs> Look at fucking real talk. Fucking Holy shit. Look at real talk. That's fucking. <laughs> so I didn't. Tommy, all us rappers smoke candy pins now, guys. <laughs> I didn't know that shit. 
You know, it's fitting because it is Pride Weekend, and that's what you look like when you're <laughs> doing one of those. <laughs> that's fucking ridiculous. Dude, dude, dude. <laughs> that's real talks that's ridiculous. In, dude, real talks in stunned disbelief. Yeah, if anything, all X's fans, we should go jump this motherfucker. <laughs> that's what happened. Cheers. They'll see it coming from a mile away. Listen, Ontario, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Not everybody looks like Drake up in Canada. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, why is there five black guys looking really angry walking up the street, eh? <laughs> uh, they're not here for the hockey there's game, eh? Black guys. I think they're coming from Michael McCrudden. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you think. The only, the only black thing at a hockey game is the puck. <laughs> I am proud of the new sponsors, ISIS, who are trying to bring freedom to Syria. <laughs> That's like having a fucking hot dog vendor at a funeral. <laughs> Get your hot dogs here! Get your hot dogs here! Get, <laughs> get your hot dogs here! Get your, I got a Yankee and Mets hat for you too! How about that? Get your the, Hey, look, do you want a New York Yankees button? Do you, do you like a button? Derek Jeter jersey over Derek here! Derek Jeter! Jeter jersey! Throwback! Throwback! Guy retired from four years ago! Throwback jersey! Welcome. Well, he had three strikes and now he's out. Yeah, my my condolences, you hip hop fans. My <laughs> condolences. Get a Yankee. Oh. You can wear it backwards. That Yankee hat. That's what you hip hop guys do, don't you? <laughs> yeah, get your candy pins here. Candy pins. Here. I got it all. Oh, you want some weed? All right. That's all. <laughs> there you go. Hey, I'm shocked, bro. They're, they're all the same. I am shocked. <laughs> Michael McCrudden. Hope you like that. If you want to see the full episode, click in the left box.